raw material. According to the use requirements of bearings, select bearing steel with high hardness, high wear resistance and good toughness. Heating. The embryo material will be heated to a suitable range of forging temperature, generally in 1050 to 1100 degrees Celsius. Unloading. According to the size specification of the bearing parts, cutting the steel into suitable blanks. Reduce the height and increase the diameter of the stock by applying pressure. Punching. Preparing the inner diameter of the inner and outer rings of the bearing for subsequent machining. Reaming. The punch stock is put on the mandrel to enlarge the hole diameter gradually. At the same time, the wall thickness is reduced to meet the size requirements of the bearing rings. Forming. Use the molding die to form the final forging of the wheel rings to achieve the design shape and size of the bearing rings. Using fan to blow air to the forging. Accelerated airflow for cool. Improves the organization and properties of the forging and reduces the oxidized skin. If you would like to learn more about bearing system solutions, please feel free to contact us. Follow Rangyun Bearings.